Hey YouTube, today we're going to be doing a quick review of my new uh, purchase. Uh, before you go flagging the video, it is about a firearm. It is in accordance with the new policy that YouTube brought forth. YouTube's policy simply states that you cannot show the modification of firearms or the making of ammunition. Uh, those things are prohibited. Uh, things such as binary triggers, bump stocks, and um, you know, basically making the gun illegal. Not going to be doing that today. Uh, this is in accordance with YouTube's policy. Um, I will, however, be doing a simple review of the Taurus Judge and uh, going over one modification that I have made to it to make it more user friendly. Uh, the only modification that I'm talking about is a grip. Simple grip. So, moving on. Uh, this is what I got. This is the Taurus Judge and the ATI Scorpion X2 grip. Uh, not This video is not endorsed in any way by ATI. If you'd like to find the grip, uh, do a quick Google search. I'm sure you'll find it. It's not hard to find. I found mine for about $20. Anyway, it's got this wonderful, almost like skateboard grip tape type of grip on here. Very grippy. Uh, has this rubber back strap, which is really nice. Uh, fits the hand well. Uh, now, the reach to the trigger from the grip is increased very slightly. As you can see, this grip would hug up to the trigger there. And this one, as you can see, little further reach however it's not bad if you have some big gorilla hands like me uh, as you can see from the other side there we go without my hand in the way the only reason I'm keeping my hand here is I don't like putting the serial number to my firearms on my videos so uh, watch somebody else's review if you want to know what that area looks like doesn't look any different than the other side Anyway, moving on, uh, as you can see, unloaded, chamber check, so, operation, very, very simple, this is to open it, you have your little rod here to spin the cylinder, close it, rotate it till it clicks and locks into place, pull the hammer back, pull the trigger, bang, very simple. Another feature of the gun is this. This is the Taurus key. If you're familiar with Taurus's firearms, you know about this already. However, I will include it in the video because it is part of this gun. That little thing there, insert the key, give it a quarter turn twist till it clicks. Now you've just rendered this gun useless. You've rendered this thing a paperweight. So, if you have small children in the home, or young adults even, this is a very useful feature. You can lock this out, prevent unauthorized use, and essentially turn this into a paperweight, make it a very safe weapon. I do not in any way advocate leaving your guns down around children or young adults. Keep your guns safe, keep it locked up, uh, keep it ready but keep it safe. Uh, safety is a big issue with a lot of people, uh, especially if you have small children. Uh, just make sure you're keeping everything safe. You know, keep it out of their reach if at all possible. Um, I know a lot of you can't really afford, you know, huge gun safes and things like that. So you're, you know, trying to keep your gun somewhere that's hidden that's not a foolproof method. Kids are smart. Some kids are smarter than their parents. So keep it out of their reach. Keep it safe. Keep it locked up. Um, if you can't afford anything else, put a trigger lock on it. It may be big. It may be bulky. But it keeps them safe. Uh, anyway, I'll wrap this video up by saying uh, everybody out there, stay safe. Uh, review the YouTube policy for yourself. 
and realize that they're not all anti-gun. They're not gun grabbers going and coming after your guns. They're not trying to demonize every video about guns. Uh, they're simply just trying to take some of the bad content off of YouTube. And I welcome that. I welcome that. I'm not 100% in agreement with what they specifically kind of demonize. I'm not in agreement with that. However, I understand it can be a liability. Videos telling people to put themselves in dangerous situations. Um, also, the manufacture of ammunition. Uh, that's something that I do not blame them at all for taking that off of YouTube. Um, especially videos that have people doing stupid things with firearms. Um, yeah, I, I hate to call out names, but um, Demolition Ranch, <clears throat> uh, nothing against you, but, you know, some of the things that you've done <laughs> really shouldn't be on YouTube. I mean, I, I know it, it's science, and I understand that as a gun owner. I want to know in the end of the world scenario what I can and can't do, but that type of content shouldn't be on YouTube with kids. There should be some kind of an age restriction to that, uh, some kind of age verification process, and if YouTube is watching, I really hope that you find a way of doing that and keeping that content, but keeping that content for adults only. So I'm going to close this video with be safe, uh, subscribe, like if you feel inclined to do so. Uh, if you are looking for the ATI Taurus Grip, um, do a Google search. The ATI uh, X2 Scorpion Grip, uh, you'll find it, I'm sure. Uh, there's thousands of retailers out there. I'm not going to link one. As per YouTube's new policy, you cannot link to anywhere that distributes firearm parts. So to be safe, I'm not putting any links in my description from now on. I will not tell anyone where to get it. Uh, if you are looking for it, I'm sure you'll find it. Uh, so in this video, with ha have a great day, be safe, and like, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye.